Hello, this is Adrian Jr. with Sin City Outdoors, and earlier today we went bluegill fishing. Got an, a lot of bluegills, so in this video I'm going to show you guys how to clean them. Welcome to Sin City Outdoors! Fishing. Hunting. Great I'm gonna find the biggest one to make the video on. The rest I'm just gonna put in the ice chest for now. So this first way is gonna have bones, but you get the most meat. It's probably the easiest. You just keep the skin on, you're just gonna scale them. So after you're done scaling this fish, what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut at an angle behind the gill all the way up and you're going to turn the knife and follow the spine don't cut through it though you can put your hand down for some support and just start cutting they can be pretty slippery so you got to hold on to them so we're just going to cut down and all the way through And that's how we're going to cook it. We're just going to take out the guts and everything. And after you're done doing that, we just cook it head and all. That's how you make, how you get the most meat. You just got to make sure to take out the gills after you do that method. All you got to do is just, almost like you're cleaning a trout, just pull out the gills. Okay, this fish is good. So we're just going to give him a rinse and he's ready to fry. We'll go on to the next fish. So on this fish, you're going to take off the skin and we're going to make it boneless. So all you're going to do is come up behind, do a cut, find the gill plate all the way up, and then you're going to follow the backbone. Come through, stop. It's almost like a lot of the other fish, but gonna run your knife along the backbone lift it continue running it following those ribs let the ribs guide you and once you reach about skin on the ribs you just poke your knife through like that and you're gonna cut Flip it over. You're gonna have it like this. You're gonna cut down to the skin and follow it along. That's good, but they have little tiny bones right here. You can film if you run your fingers this way. So I just cut like that, right along them. Cuts them right out. You got a nice little fillet, completely boneless. Now we just do the other side. 